And uh, here's the latest latest uh, information we got. Uh, the uh, the agent says that uh, she's just they just talked to the boss in New Mexico, uh -huh. and that he says that you must hold out. That uh, uh, just hold on until after the election. Now, uh, uh, we know what you is saying to them out there. Yeah. We we are we're pretty well informed on both ends. Yeah. Uh, Nixon's man traveling with him today said. Uh, quote that uh, he did not understand that you was not aboard. Yeah. Did you see that? Did you see that? Uh, no, I don't think I did. Who was that? Uh, we don't know. We have no idea. Uh, he speaks through these unknown people. Yeah. Now we told uh, Nixon, as we told you, uh, that. Uh, well, let me get the transcript. Uh, while this was going on, we went out to Chua and talked to him and all of our allied countries, and they all tentatively agreed. Yeah. Now, since that agreement, we have had problems develop. First, there's been speeches that we ought to withdraw troops. Yeah. That was Humphrey and uh, uh, Bundy. Yeah. Or that we stop bombing without any obtaining anything in return. Yeah. Or some of our folks, including some of the old China lobby, are going to the Vietnamese embassy and saying, please notify the president that if he'll hold out to November the 2nd, they could get a better deal. Uh -huh. Now, I'm reading their hand, Everett. I don't want to get this in the campaign. Okay. And they oughtn't to be doing this. This is treason. I know.